So we're at the gym right now and this gym is freaking sick. I'll show you guys later. But look at this treadmill. And you can see outside. So awesome. And there's a unicorn right there. This workout room is huge. I don't know if you guys can see it. Good afternoon. We're on our way to breakfast. Well, it's like almost lunchtime, but it's like 11, right? It's like 11.30. Isn't it? Yeah. Oh, it's almost 11.30. And we haven't eaten yet because we went to the gym and then got ready, Only but... you would make a gym on vacation. It's here! We finally came to breakfast. Taiwanese breakfast. I forget what this is called, but I had that bing. San Juan. Yeah, I don't know what this is called. Something bing, some type of bing, and then soy milk, which is dou jiang. So we're at this place called Yong He Dou Jiang, and totally failed earlier because we went to another place, and the line was like wrapped around the whole restaurant, I guess. So we went back up to the MRT and came there. And now we're eating Taiwanese food. I'm so excited to just for a time. Oh yeah. How look good. Ew, don't do that. Mm. All of this is only one twenty five NT, which is like three dollars and four dollars. Less than five dollars. Yeah. Crazy. I love that time. Like so freaking hot. Okay. Try it. I like how it's like so perfectly wrapped. Like little pickle thing in here. You see it? Yeah. So good. So this Taiwanese breakfast is at the Da'an MRT station. So I would definitely recommend it. It's so bomb. Oh, that one? The white? Yeah. And now we're going to Joe Fun. Thank you. Hi, Michal. We took the 
Uber here and there are so many people here, it's insane. But I need to find the lantern thing. It's not like on a stair staircase. <laughs> Finally, there's space. That's the best. Space. I feel like this. This street is like taking forever. I don't know where it is. They told me to just keep going, but I feel like we've been walking for like forever. Hopefully, it's soon. I smell that so dope. I lost him. What happened? All right, it's raining like a mofo. Oh my god. Wow, this is pretty. Look at those buses just stopped. It's raining pretty hard now. Let me get you under. Under my umbrella. And we still can't find where the stairs are. But it might, oh shoot, it's raining like crazy. But it might be because there's a lot of people, so I can't really tell. They're just like stuck. Now there's nobody here, but I tried to take a picture with this thing the past 10 minutes. So I found the staircase, but there's so many freaking people that I don't know how I'm gonna take a picture. Did you expect that to be this way? No. Because when my sister and my dad came, and when everybody else came that I see pictures of, there's literally nobody here. Really? So I think I'm in bad luck. So we just came on the bad time. I think so. <laughs> Which kind of sucks because there's literally so many people. Look at all that. Uh, how am I going to compete with them to get a picture? I remember my sister's picture. There was nobody here. And she just sat on the ground and took a picture. I'm like, what the heck? So finally, people like moved after like 10 minutes. Justin's so over it. He hates crowds. But it's like so nice here. I just wish it wasn't raining. And I wish I got to explore more because there's so many people that I just like don't really want to. And I'm sad about the train lantern thing so you can write down what your, what was it called? Write down your goals and like happiness and health and stuff. Yeah, your wishes, I guess, and then let it like fly into the air, but it's raining. So I don't think we can do that today. And that's like the one thing that I really, really wanted to do. But it's okay. At least I got these cute pictures. And maybe we can come back when we come back from Kaohsiung, but I don't know. Okay. Next, I think we're just gonna go home because our Uber is actually waiting for us. Like, he's so nice. He's waiting for us for like an hour, I think. It hasn't been that long. But he's gonna take us back, and then I don't know what we're gonna do. But we'll see. Back into the crowd we go. Honestly, insane. I can't believe it. Come on, yes, no one here. Almost to the end. We're almost there. I feel like it was this way. Never mind. I think I thought we were almost there, but no. We finally made it out after like 30 minutes. So after we got home from Chelsea, I felt like super sick. I felt like super sick, and so I took a nap. Like, well, it felt like it was only, or felt long, but just said I looked up for 30 minutes, and the first 20 minutes, I think I was just trying to fall asleep. But now we're out eating ramen, and it's raining outside, so that kind of sucks. But I feel a lot better after taking an Advil and taking that. Now we're out for dinner, and it's like 6 6 15, but it feels super late. Alcoholic. 
I have to. Why? Over here all day. It's hard. Not true. <laughs> and this ramen place I've been to before, and it was really good back then. I feel like I came here like four years ago or something. And then the last time I was here, my dad came, so me and my sister went shopping instead. Typical. And now we're back. And we went to go get cronuts. <laughs> Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Wow, that was fun. I got a tonkatsu ramen with hard boiled eggs, or not half, like half corn, bamboo shoot seaweed. This looks so good. And his looks so good. He got barbecue pork. And we also got some spinach with corn. I need that. Ooh, our chicken nuggets came. Hey, hey. How is it? One out of ten. Harsh. Oh, really? Harsh judge. Alright, my turn. This hard boiled egg is so good. Did you get me this? Yeah. You ate it? No, I broke it. I feel like I can't critique it because I don't eat as much ramen as Justin does. But I think it's good. <laughs> We're at this place right next to the ramen place that we went to. This place is called La Fair Apple, and we're just getting a drink, or I am. Just is not. I don't have a sweet tooth. It's not sweet. It's a drink. I got grapefruit green tea. Oh, yeah, yeah. Grapefruit, grapefruit juice with aloe. I don't think there's tea in here. And there's real grapefruit in there. Let's walk. Thank you. Let's walk that way just to see if it's still there. That way? Yeah. Come on. In the rain. Thank you. First case. Mm. Not as great fruities as I thought. But still good. Sorry I didn't make an outro for you guys, but here are a few tips about Joe Fun that I would suggest. First, don't go on a weekend. I would suggest going Monday through Thursday to try and beat the crowds. Second, take an Uber. It's so much easier than trying to take the bus and it's less than around $800 each way. Or 800 NT, I mean. And I went on a Friday, so it might have been more expensive than if you went on Monday through Thursday. Number three, ask your Uber driver to wait for you. Well, only if you don't take too long. We only took an hour because we didn't want to stay in the crowds, and plus it was raining. Number four, go in the morning or the noontime when there's less people. If you want to have space and take your time walking around without having to wait in the crowd. And I think that's it for my suggestions. Hopefully it helped you guys a little bit. We didn't actually get to eat or buy anything because we didn't want to wait. But there is a ton of stuff in there. So you guys should definitely check it out. Thank you guys for watching and I will see you guys in my next Taiwan video. Bye!